And topping our news tonight at 5, nearly a year ago, we told you about numerous students who were fighting Santa Barbara Business College, claiming the school was not keeping up to its end of the deal, providing inadequate services and lying to lure prospective students. Now, one of those students is now the first one to win an arbitration against SBBC. 23 ABC's Christine Dins in studio with details and reactions from that student. Christine? Last July, Nisha Provera and several students complained that Santa Barbara Business College collected their tuition, but did not provide necessary books and supplies, hired bad teachers, lied about financial aid and loans, and when students confronted the administration, school officials brushed them off. Provera led a legal battle against the school and recently won. It was a big fight, but it was well worth it. <laughs> Nisha Pereira claims Santa Barbara Business College cheated her out of an education and tried to cheat her out of tens of thousands of dollars. So Pereira filed an arbitration suit against SBBC. In it, she claimed the school failed to find her an externship. Well, I had been communicating with career services, the administrator, the director from the school, and nobody ever got back to me. SBBC then dropped her from school after she missed two weeks straight because she had no externship to go to. They pretty much dropped me for something that I had no control over. When Pereira confronted school officials about being unfairly dropped. They weren't trying to hear anything that I had to say. They weren't willing to work with me. They just said you're dropped. But they kept her tuition. So she filed an arbitration suit. I wanted them to pay back my tuition because of the fact that I never got to finish school. I didn't receive my degree, I couldn't get a job what I went to school for, so I was pretty much stuck with a $33,000 student loan debt. Pereira won the arbitration. The American Arbitration Association ruled the school's actions were invalid. The arbitrator said, quote, the evidence shows the school was manipulative in its actions and intentionally deceived claimant, end quote. So the arbitrator said, you know, the award goes to her because of the fact that she communicated with you guys, she kept in contact with you guys, and you guys did nothing about it. You know, there's no reason why she can't finish school, but you guys are making it difficult for her. Pereira was awarded more than $26,000. I feel relieved. I feel happy. Pereira says this battle has inspired her. I'm actually going to go back to school for law because um, this taught me. <laughs> how to fight for myself, how to stand up for myself. Um, nobody should have to go through this, and I would love to fight for people's rights. SVBC did not return our repeated calls for comment. In the studio, I'm Christine Din, 23 ABC.